We were looking for love, girl. Hey, will we be up in this club, girl? My name is Yvonne Trey. I'm from Coachella. I'm an artist, I guess, uh, singer, performer, uh, songwriter, uh, just a little bit of everything, I guess. Um, just write music, man. Enjoy it. I grew up listening to uh, like a lot of R&B, a lot of old school stuff. Um, my parents, I'm Mexican American, so you know, uh, my parents listen to a lot of uh, Spanish music, like boleros and things like that. Um, that's pretty much. I feel like that's where I got my soul from. Uh, it's just just love songs and oldies. So that's kind of pretty much sums up my background in music. Is you know, just growing up with good old soul music, Motown, stuff like that. Been here my whole life, to be honest. Grew up here. Uh, I grew up in Coachella. You know, every every now and then I just get into some some different. You know, and I feel like I'm always inspired by someone either new that's coming up in the in the market or you know just the old school stuff but I, honestly everything I, I love any everything from you know you go back to like the oldies you know I used to I used to as a kid I used to listen to like Art LeBeau growing up on the radio uh, anything from there to you know Freddie Mercury the Queen all the way to like Marvin Michael Jackson was like one of my biggest obviously one of my biggest influences, you know, I grew up watching Moonwalker, you know, uh, so I think just a little bit of everything, man. I'm just inspired by just music overall and just just to feel if I if I if I groove with it, I like it, man. I just, you know, this inspiration all over around. Well, my name is Yvonne, um, just spelled a little differently as an artist, right? Um, but Trey was just uh, just kind of like it just felt right. I mean, I was I was a singer, songwriter, and like a performer. So just three things, it, which just made sense. I think it was uh, at the time I uh, I had a manager at the time, and he gave me the idea. I hated it at first, and then I, uh, at one point in time, I was I wanted to like a new start. I had a, I I had always been working on music. And I wanted like a new start, and I said, you know what? Let's 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 uh, let's start from scratch. Let's do Yvonne Trey, and so it just felt right, and I'm just rolling with it for now. Don't know if it's gonna be forever, but you know, I'm just feels good right now. Like I love making music. If I can get if I can get paid for doing it, which I already do, I feel like that's that's it. I'm happy with I'm content with what it is, and anything greater is just a blessing, you know. Anything greater is just a blessing. I, I'm enjoying my, my time. I, I write music. I perform. I get paid for it. I hang out with my friends who are amazing musicians, my band. Um, I'm content. Like I said, anything that, that comes after that is just it's a blessing. And, you know, and I, I'm pretty much grateful right now to just be doing music because that's what I do full time. Being able to record and, and sing and perform uh, for a living. And I mean, some performances like we were able to, I was able to perform at Coachella Fest in 2015, um, which was pretty cool. I was the first artist from Coachella to ever play at Coachella. So I think that's pretty cool. Um, and that was a, like a, a long time goal of mine growing up, especially, you know, growing up right outside of the, the music festival, being in my backyard. Um, I remember going to the like concerts and just you know, not being able to get in some years to watch some of my favorite artists. So to be able to perform an event like, you know, at the at that event was pretty, uh, it was pretty dope. <laughs> like I said I'm just an artist from Coachella. I play R&B music. Um, I'm releasing music. I'm actually releasing a single on, on October 1st it's called Woke Up. Uh, it's going to be my first single off my uh, EP album. Uh, that's still not uh i still don't know what we we're gonna call it yet but it's um but it should be coming out uh early i would say january because it's just been postponed for a while just because of uh how long it's been taking to to really just uh make it sound make it sound close to where i want it to sound and where i'm fully satisfied or at least somewhat satisfied but um yeah that's pretty much it i just releasing music uh october 1st Check it out. You can check me out at EvonneTrey.com. It's double E V double A N. Um, or you just holler at my uh, social medias. Instagram was 
pretty much a, a thing. YouTube, of course, uh, if you want to listen to my music, any of my videos, live performances, you can check me out on YouTube. Um, other than that, like uh, streaming, if you want to stream any of my songs, iTunes, on all major platforms, Spotify, you know, where, wherever you can find it. Thanks to all the artists that are around here who are uh, making it extremely uh, easy for us to just kind of continue to perform and you know the flusters who who uh, who brought us out here today uh, to perform here at the Saguaro um, Plastic Ruby uh, you got a uh, Brightner uh, big shout out actually big shout out to Will Will uh, Sturgeon from Brightner who as a matter of fact is uh, one of the producers that has been working on my project uh, specifically the one uh, specifically our release the uh, woke up which is going to be releasing october 1st he's one of the producers on on that project so shout out to will what up will where you at bro i just want to thank uh coachellavalley.com for having me on this interview and uh peace out <laughs>